and you're you know working with professional fighters like I, before we get into you guys coming here in Vegas and, and what brought that on right. and, and what that's all about kind of tell people about the format that you guys use because it is different than what people have seen well that's right yeah the format um, you, you know we we've taken the, the pretty much kind of like the K1 format style and and apply it to American wear sports and that is you know uh, regular season playoffs and championship and you know anybody that knows obviously basketball football um you name it baseball and so on um there's a regular season playoffs and championship and so uh in the play in the pfl uh that's the, the format and then guys have to fight two regular season fights to qualify for the playoffs and to qualify for the playoffs you got to win to earn points um and if it's a uh, first round knockout you get extra three points, second round knockout or submission. You get two points, third round finish, uh, knockout or, or submission, one point. So guys can go home with either three, uh, five, four, or six points. And um, and those points would then sit them in the playoffs on who to fight. So, you know, the number eight guy will fight the number one guy, number one guy, the number seven guy will fight number two, and so on. Uh, and... When we come to Las Vegas for the playoffs uh, here at the Mandalay Bay, uh, the fighters will be competing. They'll be fighting two fights in you know uh, in one night to qualify for the championship. And so the the last the two finalists will then compete at the end of the year uh, for the million dollars as well as the uh, world title. The three weeks of playoffs here in Las Vegas at Mandalay Bay in October, concluding with Halloween actually uh, here in. Here in Vegas, uh, so I, I think you know you, you explain it there. You get to the playoffs, and then that first round to get into the championship, you got to win the two fights on one night. How have fighters kind of responded to that? That's kind of old school MMA, right? Right, it, it, it really is, and uh, and guys love it. I mean, you know, um, when you're you're earning good money to compete twice because the, the the quarterfinals is two rounds, and then the semifinals uh, is three rounds. So really, they're fighting you know, like a championship fight right. in, in one night. So um, everybody that's signed on and, and become a, a part of the PFL from the last season to this season, everybody loves it. They love the format. And I've had nothing but, uh, you know, praises about the format and how guys, you know, have to win to get to that title shot. And, you know, we, we mentioned it. That's, that's, how, that's how it was done in the old school, and that's how guys – uh, used to do it, but now guys are so focused on that, you know, prepare for that one opponent, that one style, get ready for that guy and study him. It adds a whole new wrinkle to try to potentially fight two completely different style fighters in one night. So uh, what kind of element does that add to you? Listen, it's, it's, uh, it's something that I came up with. I mean, you know, when I fought in K1, I, I fought three fights in one night right. in Grand Prix. You know what I mean? And so uh, for me, it, it kind of, because there's a different kind of mentality going into that. You go into one fight and, you know, you go there and you, 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 you fight a real tough fight. You come back and now you've got to mentally, mentally dig down to the core of your soul and dig another fight out. And, of course, then you win that and you come back out and do it again. Um, but that takes special fighters. That takes special people. Not everybody can do that. And I get it. I understand that. Um, I've had fighters that have said, personally have said to me that, you know, uh, they, they love the full match, but for them, it's, they just can't see themselves fighting two or three fights in one night. So, listen, it takes a special athlete to be able to, to you know, come out, put on a great battle, and, and go back and half an hour later, 45 minutes later, come back out and do it again. You know what I mean? And so yeah. that's what makes it, uh, I think, more special is because, you know, athletes like to kind of push the boundaries, and when you continue to do that, I think it, it uh, brings out uh, the greatness in fighters. 